Hey everyone, it's your Korean girl Gina Kim and welcome back to my channel. Yeah, so today I'm gonna react to some Instagram ads again. Because I don't know why, but Instagram, they recommend me just so many weird things. So I was like, huh? So do I really need them? But anyways, I bought just so many things thanks to Instagram. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> some items they were actually great but some other items they were like ah uh, i mean do i really need them i mean why did i buy them you know i felt like that and some items actually they never arrived so i'm like what's wrong with you instagram ads <laughs> so you know the other day like was it like two months ago that's so long time ago already yeah like two months ago i already made a video about me reacting to some ridiculous you know instagram ads here in korea and some beauty standards and i know there are just so many weird things and i love them just so much i don't know i'm so weird i mean i'm so perverted i i love those fake and ridiculous ads and I really want to roast them oh by the way this beautiful cardigan with this beautiful you know cute gold buttons like heart buttons is from another stories thank you so much for the free clothes and let's react to those videos oh my god yeah it's not a video but yeah it's written in korean so you are not gonna know what they're saying but i found this is so funny well actually this product is not from korea this one is from france so yeah french subscribers i really want to ask you guys okay so it says that okay these pills they are great because it changes your fart smell into rose fragrance what guys wait is it really something possible or is it like fraud or what what is it is it like a joke so they actually ordered yeah this is ad but anyways they ordered and it took like 20 days uh arrived from france so they actually bought this one oh my god <laughs> okay so just imagine that guys okay so you took the pills yeah these pills and then you just farted in front of your boyfriend because you are so confident with the smell and then you know you just fart and then it becomes like and then your boyfriend is like oh, that's so fantastic what is this fragrance oh my god is this rose just imagine that oh my god this is so <laughs> i mean is it really effective or not i'm so curious about that just please let me know anyone if you know about that but at the same time i feel very sad about this i mean somebody needed these pills right so they that's why they invented this product so somebody actually felt like my even my fart smell yeah it should be fragrant they had that pressure maybe i i i i am willing to actually yeah take these pills and then i want to experiment <laughs> i want to smell my own <laughs> fart and then yeah if it smells like shit then you're done <laughs> This is so fraud, I don't know, this is so fake. French subscribers, if you know about anything about like this, then please let me know if it's true or not. Oh, the case itself, it looks so sketchy. That's not even a woman, you know? That's like a grandpa and, and he's sitting in a leaf. It says it smells like road, something like that. I don't know, it's just so sketchy, I don't know. So weird. And I don't like the fashion. What is this fashion? Is it Peter Pan or... <laughs> <laughs> let's see another ad okay so this one yeah it's also written in korean so you are not gonna know it but yeah it's definitely about your breast your you know your chest and it's before using it and after using it like 56 days after so if you use this what is this one is it like ample or liquid or something like that and then who okay so they just applied this one and then oh it's oil gosh okay it's oil and your breasts become like this what 
really? <laughs> That's so fake, right? Okay, so uh, no one, yeah, nobody needs plastic surgery anymore. You know, I love watching Dr. Yoon's reacting videos. I don't know if you guys know about that, but then if you see that, there are just so many like botched plastic surgery cases, and there are just so many crazy plastic surgeries and then yeah you actually don't need them you are just wasting your money when you can actually just apply this oil and you know make your chest bigger breast bigger gosh these are just so fake there's another one oh my god this one i love this one so much <laughs> okay there's the essence or serum and then I mean, it's so bad photoshopped, oh my god. So they try to, you know, they try to photoshop the video and this is what happened. Gosh, I think I'm gonna be better at photoshop. Yeah, this one is just so bad, like, you just blurred them out, you know? You can just see that they blurred the poor parts, so you just cannot see it, but what is it? Is it after effect or something? What did they use? This is just so bad and I want to read comments because I don't even know if it's Korean thing or not. Okay, let's see. <laughs> okay, do people really believe it works like that? So fake! Haha, <laughs> Photoshop. Nice Photoshop. <laughs> is this real? God, it looks so fake. Ever wonder the ethics of a company will <laughs> just sell anything to make a profit with fake ads? <laughs> Yeah, just there are so many fake eggs in this world and I'm like, wow, this is so interesting. Yeah, I'm really wondering if there's anyone who's gonna buy this after watching this fake ads. Because this is so obvious, it's fake and <gasps> wow, why 200k views? Yeah, you you wasted your money. <laughs> oh, there's bug and shit. Okay. Okay, the next ad. Okay, this is definitely Korean one. And this is just photo, but look at her. Okay, it's about pores again. And I know some of you guys, I mean, a lot of you guys actually, you guys ask like, why Korean women, they don't have pores? But you know what? I have like big, large pores. And you guys were like, oh, it's my first time to see a Korean woman <laughs> having like pores. But yeah, look at this photo. Oh my God. Gosh, this is just so photoshopped. It's so obvious, you know? Oh my god, you, you could do better. Oh my god, who's the marketing team? <laughs> Who is in charge of marketing? Gosh. Yeah, it's it's obvious that, you know, they just copied and uh, pasted like from another photo. Skin looks perfect and even she's wearing makeup and then her pores just look like strawberry. <laughs> and what is it? And then this is after. Are you kidding me? It's just her skin. Gosh, she just looks like that. You know, I'm, I'm so angry right now. How can you do this? You are just mocking all the people who have actually pores like me. Yeah, I have pores. <laughs> Fake ass, I'm so sad right now. I have this feeling like they stole this photo. Yeah, even the model. Did you get the permission or... I don't know, you know, a lot of ads, like Instagram ads, they just steal photos or like videos from someone else, like some famous people from Instagram, and then they just make an ad, right? I hope they didn't do that with mine. <laughs> you know, Koreans wanna have like free line, you know, like really slim face you know that line we want to have like pointed jawline pointed yeah kind of like slim slim jawline okay she has double chin but what okay that was before and that's after what did you do what did you do just cream oh okay it's a it's a pack kind of pack before and after <laughs> Peptide, yeah, I know peptide is good, but gosh, this ad is so fake. I mean, you are literally just doing like this and then I have double chin. And then after using that, I don't have double chin. It's like that. Oh my God. <laughs> what is wrong with these people? <laughs> I mean, okay, marketing guys here. Yeah, working in this uh, industry. Oh my God, you, you need to think about it. Ooh, lots of comments actually. 
Okay, over 1,000, 1,000 comments and I cannot wait to read them. I actually bought two things and oh, it's actually very effective. Oh, it's great. I can feel that they are bots. They just paid for the comments and they're all the fake accounts, I guess. Um, oh, it's really great. And they are actually replying. Oh my God. It's great for lifting. Wow. Oh, is this real? No. <laughs> I, of course, they can have that you know, effect like, oh, making your skin like tight, maybe tighter. That can be, yeah, possible. But I'm just saying that. I'm not saying that the product is not effective, but just I'm saying that this ad is just too much, okay? And there's another one for your, you know, jawline again. Gosh. <laughs> what? Okay, uh, um, what is going on? So that is like a cream or like, I don't know, like serum. And then they were using like this one. <laughs> but the model, she looks so frustrated. Like, why am I doing this? Why am I here? She looks like so frustrated. I'm like, I'm like so depressed. Why am I doing this? <laughs> Another model, she's so... She's so like depressed. Gosh, why am I doing this? <laughs> Gosh. Okay, but yeah, I've seen some products like that. And yeah, actually they have that instant effect. Oh my God, she's again, she's so sad. Why everybody's so sad? Yeah, they look all sad. I don't know why. Is this like a, a strategy of the sad or something? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, anyways, this is amazing. Okay, but the thing is that guys, the thing is that guys, this is very instant, but we don't really know if this is gonna last. Like, yeah, this is just for that moment, I think. I heard that there is like, like, what is that? Like bond, you know, that kind of ingredient is inside. So it's just like sticking your face like this. And then literally you are using like tape, something like that. Okay, and then I wanna read comments. What is it? Is it plastic surgery? Is it possible? I want to buy it. Wow. The reviews are great. Yeah, buy it. Something like that. Oh my gosh. So obviously they bought the comments too. Yeah, I, I, I used to work in marketing areas. So I know how it's going, you know? Yeah, this is actually a popular one. So I was like, wow. <laughs> yeah, it's like just drawing something. And then, ooh, it makes your hairline great. And yeah, if you don't have enough hair, then this is great. So it's called like tattoo brush. Oh, ooh, cover spray. Okay, for your hairline. So you just draw it like that. And then, yeah, that's actually, that's actually, I want to try that one actually. Yeah, if I lose more hair, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, that one is okay. Yeah, it's not that bad. This product, I hate it just so much. I hate the product concept and I hate the ad and everything. This is like a, you know, review type of <laughs> ad. And I bought it and then everyone like, oh my God. My boss, he said, oh, did you change your fragrance? And then, you know what, my heart like, I got like butterflies in my heart. This is amazing. Okay, <sighs> this is too much. I just changed my perfume and then my boyfriend, not boyfriend, boyfriend asked me if you got any plastic surgery <laughs> because I look so beautiful. Okay, you just changed your perfume and then everybody thinks that, oh, you got plastic surgery because you became so pretty. This is so, so this fragrance is to seduce somebody. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, that makes sense because a lot of people, they use fragrance for that reason, right? But this one is just too much. What? With fragrance only, people look pretty like 500 times more. That's what they said, like, seriously? <laughs> oh my God! They say, oh my God, this fragrance is so amazing. I feel like I'm gonna have all the men in the world. Should I try this one? I'm gonna try this one and if no one asks me like, oh, what is that fragrance? Or, oh, you look so pretty, like 500 times more. 
then I'm gonna sue you. <laughs> So there are actual reviews? No way. No way. <sighs> oh, I don't even want to translate that into English. Gosh, you can see there's a lot of men with this fragrance. Gosh, I, I, I don't really like it. Okay, you just wear something feminine and then just use this sexy fragrance. Then guys, they're gonna crazy for you that's what they say what's wrong with these people who's the marketing person oh my god i need to talk to this person gosh okay it's around 30 it's about 30 us dollars yeah you could say that just oh this is like oriental fragrance and then it has five ingredients you know yeah it looks better right now but why, why did you have to use these reviews like fake reviews oh my god this is so funny yeah for this one i just wanted to address like yeah if you see those ads they <laughs> you can see that this ad is just so fake i mean her skin right now is glowing like perfect like it looks like coated you know oh my god looks like jelly jelly but but you know what for like before before face they they just exaggerate too much sometimes you know they just make some freckles with some makeup products and then they make your skin like dirty and then they just use this product and then they're like oh this is after you know but it looks like yeah they just make the before face look so bad that's the strategy i know and there is no even no comment section i know why why because people say something bad right okay great okay that's it oh my god it was so fun <laughs> okay there are so many crazy products in this world and i got to know about them through instagram ads thank you so much and i think instagram people they should do something for you know like fake ads or like photoshopped ads or you know like stealing some other people's photos or videos you should do something for that i, I don't know but it's like a little like joy in my life i love watching them and i like reading the comments and i just like roasting them i love marketing just so much okay that's it for today i hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, wh which one was your favorite product and which one do you want to use personally i really want to try that <laughs> The first one, yeah, you know, the fart smell. Yeah, I really want to try that one. And yeah, just please let me know what you think about those ads yeah, through comments. And my Instagram is itchginakim and my YouTube is also itchginakim. So please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye!